Hey everyone, so here is a second question from exercise 4.1 that's a simple equation and the question is check whether the value given in a bracket is a solution to the given equation or not. So they have given different values like n is equal to 1 and n is equal to minus 2 for respective equations. We need to substitute this value in a given equation. If LHS and RHS are equal then we can say yes it is solution. If it is not then it is not a solution. Let's start solving this. So the first one we have here is n plus 5 is equal to 19. So we have to take n is equal to 1. So let us solve first LHS. So LHS is equal to n plus 5. And this is equal to 1 plus 5. 1 plus 5 is equal to 6. And in the RHS we have 19. So clearly we can see that LHS is not equal to RHS. They are not equal. So therefore we can say n is equal to 1 is not a solution. That's it. Let's go for second one. So in second we have 7n plus 5 is equal to 19 and n value we have is minus 2. Same way. LHS is nothing but 7n plus 5, right? 7n plus 5, substitute there, 7 into minus 2 plus 5. This is minus 14 plus 5, we're going to give you minus 9. But RHS is equal to 19. So 1 is minus 9 and 1 is uh, 19 so they are not equal so LHS is not equal to RHS so therefore n is equal to minus 2 is not a solution over let's go for third one So the third one is we have 7n plus 5 is equal to 19 and n value here is 2. So LHS is equal to 7n plus 5, substitute the value, 7 into 2 plus 5. 7 to the 14, 14 plus 5 is 19 and in the RHS we have 19. So clearly LHS is equal to RHS therefore we can conclude that n is equal to 2 is a solution of the given equation. Let's go for the fourth question. So fourth question we have 4p minus 3 is equal to 13 and p value here is 1. So let us check the LHS value. So 4p minus 3. So 4 into 1. In place of p substitute 1. So 4 ones are 4. So 4 minus 3 will be 1. And in the RHS we got the value as 13. So clearly LHS is not equal to RHS, therefore P is equal to 1 is not a solution. Let's go for the next one, fifth question. So next question is 4P minus 3 is equal to 13 and p value here is minus 4. So let's try with LHS. So this is 4p minus 3. So 4 into minus 4 minus 3. So 4 into minus 4 is minus 16 and then we have minus 3. So this we're gonna give us minus minus means same sign so we have to add it will become 19 and since the greater number is 16 it has a negative sign so minus 19 and here RHS is 13. So clearly we can say that LHS is not equal to RHS. Therefore P is equal to minus 4 is 
not a solution now last question that is f so in the next question we have 4p minus 3 is equal to 13 and here the p value is equal to 0 so LHS when you take it so 4p minus 3 so just substitute the value of p0 and then minus 3 so 4 0 is 0 and so 0 minus 3 will be minus 3 and RHS is nothing but 13 so again here LHS and RHS are not equal so therefore P is equal to 0 is not a solution so if the LHS and RHS are equal then we can say they are solution if they are not then they are not a solution then of the given equation so that's it I hope you have understood how we have solved this in case you have a question or a doubt you can drop a comment below and thank you so much for watching.